Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The pace at which Turkey's aerospace sector is developing its next generation fighter jet, UAVs and UCAV, it is really commendable. On 14th December 2022, the Bayraktar Kizlema UCAV, described as unmanned fighter aircraft, took its maiden first flight at higher altitude. On 16th March 2023, the Turkish fifth generation fighter jet TFX began its taxi trials. On 18th March, TAI shared the first photo of Anka 3 unmanned fighter jet, which is set to make its first flight in second quarter of 2023. On the same day, that is on 18th March 2023, Turkish advanced trainer jet, which is known as Hurjet, also began its taxi trials. On 23rd December 2022, the Hurjet has been seen coming out of its hangar on its landing gear. Turkey has planned to develop two prototypes of Hurjet. One of the prototype will perform the first flight, while the other one will be used for planned upcoming tests. Now, talking about the TAI Hurjet, it is a single engine, tandem seat, supersonic advanced trainer, and light combat aircraft under development by Turkish Aerospace Industries. The Hurjet will replace Turkey's aged Northrop T-38 Talon trainers and F-5 fighters. Hurjet will also be fielded in export market to compete and replicate the success of South Korean T-50 and SCA-50 combat version, 48 of which were recently ordered by Poland. The project was initiated by TAI in the year 2017 from its own financial resources. Talking about the technical specifications of Hurjet, it has a length of 13.6 meter, wingspan of 9.5 meter, height of 5.1 meter, and wing area of 35 meter square. The aircraft will be powered by a single F404G102 afterburning turbofan engine, which can generate maximum thrust of 79 kN with afterburner. The Hurjet will have maximum speed of Mach 1.4 a range of 2,222 kilometers and service ceiling of 45,000 kilometers. The aircraft will have G limit of plus 8 and minus 3G. The capabilities that are planned to be included in Hurjet are air to air refueling, fly by wire with parameter limiting, built in auxiliary power unit, night vision goggle compatible cockpit, heads up display, and an integrated helmet display system. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.